Kelsey Brennan Wessels, and you are watching Earth from Space on the European Space Agency Web TV. Part of Sierra Leone in West Africa is pictured in this image from the Sentinel 2A satellite, captured on December 11th of last year. The country's capital, Freetown, sits on a peninsula at the bottom of the image. Its economy revolves around its natural deep water harbor, one of the world's largest. North of Freetown and across the river, we can see the runways of the Lunjai International Airport. The area in the central right portion of the image is the Sierra Leone River Estuary. The estuary is dominated by mangroves and lowland coastal plains and is an important breeding habitat for multiple waterbird species. Diverse socioeconomic activities are supported by the estuary, such as fishing, tourism, and sea transport, which help to alleviate poverty at a community level. But the estuary is being threatened by a growing population. For example, unauthorized housing development has caused the removal of about 20 hectares of mangrove vegetation over the past five years alone. Poor waste disposal, unsustainable fishing, and many other factors are also taking their toll on the ecosystem. Some 295,000 hectares of this estuary is protected under the Ramsar Convention, an intergovernmental treaty for the sustainable use of wetlands. There are over 2,000 sites worldwide considered to be wetlands of international importance by the Convention. ESA assists the Ramsar Convention through the Globe Wetland Africa Project and the Tiger Initiative Looking After Water in Africa which provides satellite data to be used to monitor and sustainably manage these precious resources. World Wetlands Day is observed on February 2nd, the anniversary of the signing of the Convention. The theme of this year's World Wetlands Day is Wetlands for Our Future, Sustainable Livelihoods. And that brings us to the end of this edition of Earth from Space. Remember that we broadcast online every Friday at 10 o'clock Central European Time. Watch us on our website or through the ESA app on your mobile device. From the ESA Web TV Studios, I'm Kelsey Brennan-Wessels.